Anna Howard. I'm the course coordinator for engineering statics in the mechanical and aerospace engineering department here at NC State. I am contacting you today because statics is a flipped class, which is something that some of you have probably not experienced before. And I wanted to sort of tell you how class is going to go. There are also some things I want to make sure that you're already lined up with for next week. Essentially, I've flipped this class because it gives students the best success rate. I've been researching for the last many years now how best to teach statics to sophomores and others at NC State. That's my area of research. I'm trying to figure out how to get you to learn this material as easily and as successfully as possible. And the best way I have found to do that is as this flipped class. I see av course averages that are four to five points higher in a flipped class, and I see drop withdrawal fail rates that are as much as five or ten percent lower. So it really is a better success rate. What that means though is that you need to be able to come to class prepared to work. A flipped class means that you prepare the material that you would get in a lecture before you come to class. So you're going to read the textbook, and then there are skeleton notes available in your course pack. These are blanks where you fill it in as you go along to help you sort of communicate with me about what's important. What did I think you should have gotten out of that reading? Then there are videos like this one for you to watch every day that would be the kind of the lecture presentation. And there are example problems that are available in video format as well, and we'll get to those in a bit. You also want to, before you come to class, sort of look through the slides. Those are also in your course pack. Look through and see what we're going to be doing. Once you come to class, then we're going to work on problem solving. That's the more difficult part in statics, is approaching problems that you've never seen before and you don't know how to set up. So the idea of this flipped class is to do this part where you're listening, where you're absorbing material on your own time, at your own pace, and then to do the hard part, really approaching new problems when you're working in class and you have groups of students to help you, you'll have me there to help you, you'll have your TA there to help you. This is the hard part. So that's what we want to do together. And then there will be quizzes and homework for you to do on your own to make sure that you process the material, that you can actually do it, and it's not just relying on the other groups. So why am I contacting you this week? instead of waiting for class to be in. Essentially, before we begin, there are some things I want you to take a look at. I've developed a review site in Moodle that will introduce you to a lot of the technologies I use, like clickers and the Moodle site itself and all of that kind of thing, MATLAB. That's available in this re Moodle, Moodle review site, and there's information in the email for you about that. There's also a mathematics review, and the thing is, when you come to it, Many, many of the students that come to statics have not had the kind of rigorous trigonometry and matrix algebra and linear algebra that I might like you to have had. So instead of just letting you flounder, what I have done is I put it together and sort of said, this is what you need to know. So that's also available in the Moodle Review site. And there are some quizzes there that will help you get uh, feel more confident in approaching the class. So that's available for you, and then you need to have your supplies together. The text is Beer and Johnston, and there are a variety of editions. The eighth one is not particularly perfect, so do nine or ten. Um, either of those is fine. The course pack, there are, again, it's in the email how you would get that. There are a number of different ways for you to actually find the course pack. That'll be your skeleton notes and the slides from class. You'll need a clicker. We're using Turning Technologies clickers from the, like most of the other people at the university. You'll need engineering paper, and you will need for the exams, you will need to have a laptop to take your exams on, and you'll need to have an FE approved calculator to take your exams with. So that's sort of what you need to be gathering. These two you'll need right away. This one you'll need preferably right away, but certainly by the second day of class. You'll need engineering paper as soon as you start to turn in homework, so that would probably be on around day three or four. And then this, the first test, is on day nine. So that's where we're at. There's more information in the emails and online that you'll see, but I wanted to welcome you. I'm looking forward to the semester. I think it's going to be a good one. I really think that this is a good class, and I want to do everything I can to help you be successful at it.